Hey everyone. Um, hope you enjoyed your 717 portal day. So shout outs to everyone that bought the $7 um, seven card reading special. Um, you will be getting, if you haven't already got your reading, you will be getting your reading um, sometime today, July 18th. <laughs> so yeah. Um, those of you that missed out, I will be posting like other specials. Make sure you're keeping, um, you know, notice of my Instagram story and my community tab because I do post either or for my specials. So, yeah. Um, shout outs to Ming. Thank you so much for your special gift yesterday. And I hope you had a nice day. You're such a good person. Shout outs to Tanisha as well. Thanks for your special donation and gift. And I really appreciate it. Everyone, T. So, yeah, I'm going to get right into this reading. So this is going to be like what's going on because there was a major shift yesterday. Now, um, my readings are timeless. So even if you come to my readings like months and months or years, it could still resonate. Um, let's see. What is going on? What does the Divine Masculine want to say to you, Divine Femme? So these are my text messages from Heaven Cards that I made. What do you need to know? What is the divine mass I want to tell you today? Your person adores you. So this divine mass really has feelings for you. They adore you. Um, they know what they have. Okay. The divine mass is really in their love feels for the divine femme. What else does the divine mass I want to tell you? Some of you are getting a message in two days. I would love to know who. Um, so yeah, some of you are getting a message from your Divine Masculine in two days. That's a very specific message for a few people. You're moving on to better. Your Divine Masculine knows that you're not sitting around. You're not waiting forever. You are living your life. Um, you're not waiting at all, really. You're living your life. You're being in the moment. And the, this Divine Masculine knows that if they're going to make a move, they have to make the move today, <laughs> like now, because they could lose you at any moment, Divine Femme, and this Divine Masculine knows it. So yeah, so whoever these messages are for, wow. This Divine Masculine definitely knows that this divine femme is not playing around. They are no longer, you know, for a while, of course, divine femme watching, you were crying, you were upset, but whoever is watching this collective, I feel um, for this reading, they are living in their selves, like they're not, you know, focused on the divine masculine all day. They are working they're going out they're having fun they're living their best life really um the divine masculine i feel is spying actually on the divine femme seeing that they are not like holding back if someone talks to you divine femme you're going to talk to them so if another masculine energy talks to the divine femme i feel like this divine masculine is seeing that they're seeing all the attention that you're getting divine femme and it's bothering them so they're feeling like you're moving on to better um yeah so they know they have to come and speak to you oh my gosh so this divine masculine wants you to know that there's an end to the sorrow between you two um okay so this you could be seeing 919 a lot you could be seeing 616 of uh, the twos like 222 you could be seeing, of course, 1111, 111, 717 like crazy. You could be seeing um, 
711, you could be seeing 727, these are the numbers that I'm getting. So if you would like to write these numbers down and know what they mean, if you don't already know what they mean, all you have to do is Google angel number and put the number in, or you could get the book angel numbers. It's in my Amazon list. Just click on the books and you'll find it. Because, yeah, when you get these numbers, you should really look them up if you don't know what they mean, because they're messages from heaven, all right? And... I mean, a lot of people always ask me, what does this mean? What is that? Like, I can't sit there and write all day when you could just look it up yourself and Google it. So take care of yourself, okay? So this Divine Masculine wants you to know that they know that you're taking care of yourself, you're taking care of your business, and because of that, you're mirroring that energy. And this Divine Masculine, I'm getting a sense of excitement. Like, they're excited to come and show you how they've been taking care of themselves. They've been, you know, being independent. They've been establishing their own life away from codependent situations. This Divine Masculine wants to express to you and show you chills. I'm getting like tears in my eyes. This Divine Masculine is going to tell you how you made them a better person, Divine Femme. You made them a better person. You made them look at, you know, flaws within themselves. And the same for you, Divine Femme. You looked at things that you had to work on that you had, you know certain issues that you had to work on, inner childhood wounds, um, insecurity issues, you guys mirrored each other. So because of you, Divine from this Divine Masculine had to work on themselves because they knew that their life would not be great if they didn't and they would be stuck in the same vicious, toxic cycle with karmic people and karmic situations. Overall, you need to know, Divine Femme, true happiness will happen, okay? This is going to happen. This is going to be amazing. And you're going to be shocked when it does happen. You know, true happiness is coming between you two for this collective, Divine Femme, Divine Masculine. You guys are going to be together, and you guys are going to be um, really happy. So if you want a personal reading, because this is a general, you know, hit me up. My information is below. You could just hit my link tree and click on the email button. It will pop right up. Or you could just take the email and email. All right, so let's see. What else does this Divine Master want to say to you, Divine Femme? Moving in together. Wow. Oh my gosh. I got such warm energy. This Divine Masculine wants to move in with you, Divine Femme. This Divine Masculine plans on living with you. They want to wake up to you. They want to, you know, look at you and they want to have those special mornings together. Yeah, they want to move in together with you for this collective. Oh my gosh, really? You saw how many times I shuffled. Twin Flame, if you had any doubt, this is a Twin Flame situation. Okay, so do not doubt. Okay, do not doubt. This is your Divine Masculine, Divine Femme, and this is your Divine Femme, Divine Masculine. Okay, so do not doubt at all. What else? Oh my God, that's too many cards. What else? What else does your divine master want to say to you? A surprise text is coming soon. Really? So I said some of you are getting a message in two days. You could be seeing the eights a lot. There's a lot of abundance. Abundance in love, abundance in money, abundance in health. 
Okay, so a surprise text is coming soon because this divine masculine cannot hold back anymore. They don't want to hold back. They're like wasting their time. They know they're wasting time by like not speaking to you, divine femme. So within two weeks, some of you are going to get another message. So within two days, some of you are going to get a message. Within two weeks, some of you, some of you are going to get a message under that full moon, which always happens. Okay, so with the portal, 717, now the energy is going to take another height okay there's going to be a lot of things going on for the better there's going to be some movement here you've been you know bored and sad divine from some days because you've been feeling like oh you know f it i can't anymore and that's why you're like i'm moving on i can't deal with this you know i need to be happy i need love in my life i'm not gonna just like waste my whole life waiting around for someone if they're not talking the divine masculine knows that you're tired of this you're frustrated and they know that you know they need to come and talk to you or they're going to lose you forever because the universe will just send you a soulmate divine femme and the divine masculine a lot of them are getting readings a lot of them know this so within two weeks they're going to talk to you they're going to send you a message on social media a lot of you because it's a, a safe way for them uh, a lot of you they're going to text you, some of you they're going to call you, but I'm getting more like written communication for this collective. Uh, within two weeks, those of you that got messages, some of you are going to meet up with it with your Divine Masculine within two weeks from watching this video. Some of you are actually going to see them, okay? So, yeah. For those of you that this message is for, oh, I'm so happy for you. New love. That has to do with what I was saying to you this whole reading. The Divine Masculine has it in their mind that you are moving on and that you are going to have a new love if they don't speak up. So guess what the Divine Masculine are going to do to make sure that doesn't happen. They're going to come back and ask you to marry them. And they're going to want that brand new beginning. You could be seeing sunflowers a lot. Um, some of you are around the age of 35. Some of your masculines are the, around the age of 35. So you are definitely going to get that proposal, Divine Femme. So, yeah, what is the energy coming in the near future that you do not see coming, Divine Femme, from your masculine? What don't you see coming? Getting a lot of moon energy. Wouldn't be surprised if the moon card comes out. I feel like a lot is going to happen under the full moon that's coming up. Yep, I just said there's going to be transformation. So there's a lot of changes. There's lots of changes that's going to happen, okay? There's going to be transformations. Um you need to know that there's doors closing some endings are happening for you divine from with people things situations let it close because a new door will be opening masculines are closing doors closing their toxic life behind and they're coming for this new life with you divine from yep chariot card cancer energy so we just left cancer energy with the chariot card um, this is summer though, like this is like a lot of emotion, the chariot, this, there's going to be movement here. So this divine masculine is on their way and yeah, they want to be on that track with you. So this divine masculine, like I just said, um, before there's going to be a lot of movement that's going to be happening now that that 717 portal happened because that's all about meetup. Okay, in union. This divine masculine is tired of being left out in the cold. They are tired of this imbalance. They're regretting everything. They feel bad. Some of them are going through money problems. Tell me more about this. Yep, that is the emperor. Like, I don't need cards to read. I knew this was about the divine masculine. Um, this emperor wants to come forward and take charge. 
um, because of their stubborn energy, because the emperor could be very stubborn sometimes, they left themselves out in the cold and they're worried, I told you, they're worried that you're going to find that new love, right? And they're going to be left out in the cold. Um, so there's going to be movement here because they don't want to be left out in the cold. Yeah, they want to come and say hi. So they're plotting and they're planning Okay, they're plotting and planning. And some of them are going to be traveling to you. Some of them want to travel with you before the summer's over. There's going to be rebuilding. Three of Pentacles, three of Wands, three, 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 three. Like so many threes in your reading. Um, 13, 313. So there is major ascended magic going on. The, the ascended masters, the angels, the spirit guides. They are orchestrating, and with the Three of Pentacles, they want to come and rebuild. So what you don't see coming is the Divine Masculine is going to take action. They're going to move. They're going to do something, and they're going to rebuild this connection because tower moments have happened, not just one, many tower moments, all right? So they're going to want to work things out with you with the Three of Pentacles, and you are going to be shocked. And they want to be a team player. Like, they want to be a partnership. They want to live with you. That's, you know, marrying you marriage energy with the three of pentacles as well uh, hello will you marry me you know living with you there's going to be justice had here okay there's going to be balance there's going to be major balance coming for this connection and yeah you're going to be shocked some of them they want to make all their wrongs right again a lot of libra energy here but they're going to want to find the best way to do this. Like, they're going to, they want to show you, like, they know they have to take tangible action. They know they can't just say words. That's why they're going to be like, oh, will you marry me? Will you come meet with me? Will you see me? Let me show you I'm a new person. Like, they know that they have to balance this out. Some of them, they had to go to court and they had endings, right? Because they had to go to a court to dissolve a past situation. They're embarrassed because they felt like they made the right choice. They made the wrong choice. And they had to pay for it. So. We all make mistakes though, right? But they were being stubborn about it because they knew you were right. Like some of you, you warned this masculine not to do something. And they went ahead and did it. And they regretted it. You know, karmics are manipulative, <laughs> so do I mess them? That's a big deal. But I feel like a lot of them, once they were with the karmic, like, every day in their little trap, you know, some karmics, they got pregnant and trapped them, and they realized that it was a trap because they just wanted their money. They realized, like, oh, no, I'm not going to live this like this. Like, this person doesn't love me. This divine master didn't realize, like, this karmic doesn't even love me. So they had to go to court and dissolve the situation <laughs> some of them had to get restraining orders wow this came out yesterday team awesome yeah they know that you guys are on the same page you guys are together you know mindset wise you this divine masculine feels like you guys would be team awesome like together so they're gonna come and ask you out they want you back you see that they want you back they want you back they want to romance you they want to take you out you're gonna be surprised and they want to treat you well and they're gonna say sorry so they're definitely gonna tell you that they're sorry for what they did so this reading has gone on long enough um so I hope you enjoyed, and this Divine Masculine is not confused at all. This Divine Masculine knows exactly what they want, and they want you, Divine Femme. So I'll talk to you soon. Like, share, and subscribe. Bye.